Biafra agitation. Kanu's world tour, not only for Biafrans, IPOB says. Good day, my people. Welcome once again to the news channel, and this is the headlines for today. As the Kanu's world tower is said to not only be for Biafrans. And yes, you are welcome once again to Ifree's Concept TV, where you get the latest and the hottest news. Listen to the news in full. By the way, if you are yet to subscribe to this channel, make sure to do that now. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, yesterday said its agitation for Biafra and the impact of the tour of its leader, Mazinam Dikano, to made to America and Europe has not only rekindled the hope for liberation of Biafrans, but has permeated the subconscious of every black African who has come into contact with the message of redemption. A protester brandishes a banner as he takes part in a demonstration in Durban, South Africa on May 30, 2019 during a freedom march for Biafra held worldwide and organized by the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB to mark the anniversary of the unilateral declaration of independence in 1967 that sparked the brutal 30-month civil war in Nigeria. IPOB, in a statement by its media and publicity secretary, Ima Powerful, said Biafrans across the west coast of the USA has publicly pledged their moral and material support for Biafra restoration. It promised that it will do all it can to restore Biafra at the earliest possible opportunity now that its diplomatic overtures with America, Canada, Israel and other countries are yielding positive results. IPOB disclosed further that many more IPOB family meetings, influential individuals and diaspora organizations are queuing up to host our leader in various cities across the United States. As our leader, Mazinam Dikanu, and his team continues the tour of USA and Canada with emphasis on diplomatic overtures and rallying the Biafra base to restore Biafra within the shortest possible time. We, the worldwide family of the indigenous people of Biafra, commend the California IPOB family and friends for the rousing welcome given to our leader and support given to our indomitable leader during the town hall meeting held on June 15 in Los Angeles. Biafra across the USA and Canada have been energized with the message of hope and restoration which has not only captivated Biafran audiences who are fortunate enough to attend this event, but has permeated the subconscious of every black African who has come into contact with the message of redemption as evidenced by the high number of goodwill messages received by a leader from non-Biafrans. Biafrans across the west coast of the USA have publicly pledged their moral and material support for Biafra restoration as piloted by IPOB and we promise to do all we can to restore Biafra at the earliest possible opportunity by the grace of Almighty God. Many more IPOB family meetings, influential individuals and diaspora organizations are queuing up to host our leader in various cities across the United States. The next port of call for our leader, Mazu Namdikanu, in the ongoing tour will be the city of Austin, Texas on the 21st of June, where we expect Biafrans and non-Biafrans alike to gather to welcome and listen to him preach the gospel of the restoration of Biafra at the town hall meeting. After Austin, Texas, our leader will visit Chicago to meet Biafrans in the state of Illinois. From there, we will proceed to New York where we will round up the tour. And yes, my people, that is the news for today. As we see that the Biafran leader, Namdi Kano, has been going around on a tour to ensure, to preach the gospel of the Biafra secession from Nigeria. Don't forget to like this video, comment under this video, and subscribe to this channel to get more news from this channel.